All right, hey guys. Good morning, happy Monday. Charla, if you don't know me, we're gonna do a little circuit training today. Um, we have uh, some kettlebells. If you um, get started, you need kettlebells and a step today. Um, kind of doing, if you're usually kind of my class, a Monday kettlebell circuit workout. All right, let's march it out. March your wide, take it out. Step touch, right and left. So if you don't have your kettlebell today, you can always use your dumbbells. If you don't have a step, no worries. You could use a little pillow on the floor maybe, or just the floor. Two steps, two and two. That's great, Ben. Nice shuffle, shuffle. Come back. Let's go ahead and add those arms. Jab, cross. Let's shuffle. Give me those two jacks. Come back. Shuffle. Two jacks. Hold your jacks right here. Jack. Four more. All right, give me ski step front and back. Front and back. So we're going another 45 minute workout today. The warm up will be a little shorter. So we have time to get all our work in. Make it doubles. Two, two. Back to singles. Jump that rope, center, jump. Let's check it side to side. Back to center. And let's skate side to side. Push, push, push off that leg, lateral movement. Speed it up. Push. Slow it down. Push. Push. Center. Jump that rope. Nice job. All right. We're going to do that for the other side. Then we'll get moving. Ski step. Front and back. Front and back. Give me doubles. Two, two. Back to singles. Front back. Push and pull those arms. Getting warm. All right, it's coming up. Jump that rope. Let's go front back. Front back. And skate. 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 Last piece of our warm up here. Speed it up. Push, push. Let's 
slow it down. Push. Last set, right here. Give me four, three, two, last one. Good job, keep jogging for me. Gotta hit my fan, forgot to turn it on. So let me turn my fan on, then we're gonna grab our kettlebells. I'm still here. It gets hot in this room, no airflow. Gotta have my fan. Okay, so we're just gonna alternate between movements today. We have swing and then a movement, swing and then a movement. So lots of swings today. So grab your kettlebells. We're just gonna kinda go with it, no specific time, number. Just kinda go with me, like we do in class. So you're gonna give me one arm swings on that right side to start. So remember on this kettlebell swing, you're popping those hips, squeeze those glutes at the top. You're using hips, not the arms. The arm just flies because the hips pop up. Keep it going. Nice job. Heart rate's coming up a little bit with this one. Work in the back of the body. Give me four more. Four. Two. And one. Nice work. Okay. So we're doing most everything on the right side this round. See the squat thrusters next. So you're going to squat down, press up. If you need to slow it down, squat, stand, press. If you can't do a press overhead, you can squat, stand, and then curl if you want to. All right. Here we go. Down and up. Press overhead. Squat low, chest up, shoulders back. Keep going. Let's do four more. Four. Two. And one. Uh-oh. <laughs> Our lights went off. Now they're back on. Okay, back to swing. So this time, we're going to alternate swings. Right, left. Here we go. Right and left. There we go. So try to change these up since we have a lot of swings. Changing it up as we go. I can't let you get bored, right? You know I don't want to get bored either. Come on. Again, all about that hip hop. Squeeze those glutes at the top. Like you got that coin. Hold on to it. Don't drop it. Nice work here. Remember, you can be doing these same movements with your dumbbells if you don't have your kettlebell. No worries. I just thought you might like to see kettlebells on a Monday. Bring back the good old days when we got to have class. All right, guys, give me four more. Four. Two. And one. Good work. All right, next those windmills. So, on that windmill, let me show you no weight first. You're gonna turn toes out, arm up, arm down. You're gonna slide down that leg, looking up to the ceiling. You can have that weight overhead, only if you can keep it locked out. You have to bend that elbow. I want the weight down here instead, and you're coming down here. So your preference, whatever you can control. So this is that windmill, working inside the legs, working those obliques, here we go. So eyes up at that kettlebell, leg, hand slides inside that leg, toes turned out.
Nice job, all the way down, all the way up, slow and controlled. Gonna give me two more. Nice job. Okay, back to those swings. I told you lots of swings today. This time, let's do both arms together on this one. So start low for me. You can stay here or you can go all the way up. Your choice. You come all the way up. Make sure you get it all the way over your head. Lock it out. Throw it back down. Head get through and then throw it back down. Abs tight, core engaged. Keep going. Give me four more. Good work. Okay, moving on. So, next, lunges. You probably keep your heavier kettlebell. We're gonna alternate behind first, and then we'll stay behind the right leg. So on this one, remember, back's tall. I'm using my legs to get down, not my chest. So you don't look like this. I don't want you bending over. If you have to bend over, I want you to hold the weight at your side, and then Bring it in front. But if you can, pass it under. All right, let's hold it on the right every time. So go under the right. Left leg comes back. Doesn't really matter. If you're following me, I think that's what I'm on. All right, want a little extra? Pick it up. Down, pick it up. Again, you can be doing this with your dumbbell. Still working. Come on, keep going for me. Give me four. All right, one more. I'm gonna hold this one back. Lunge down and up, stay right here. Little push. Got some nice low music all of a sudden. Pulse it out. I think I mentioned we're having music issues, copyright issues. So we're having to get creative with our playlist. It might not always be our favorite top hits, but it's something better than silence. Give me four, three, two, and one. Good work. Okay, kettlebell swings again. So we got one more set of swings and one more move for the circuit. So let's go, um, let's go left arm this time. Left arm only. Pop those hips, squeeze those glutes, core, abs, tight. So do one more kettlebell move and we'll break it up, do some step cardio, and then go back and do all this on the left side. Keep going. Heart rate should be staying up a little bit with all these swings. We're gonna take it up a little more on that step. How about four more for me right here? Four, two, and one. Excellent job. Okay, so kettlebells out of the way from your step. Move mine out. Alrighty, so for step, we will go for time. So, let me get my clock going. All right, so 50 seconds each, 10 seconds to rest. Your first one, just give me some toe taps right here. You know we'll pick this up, but while you're waiting on me, toe taps. All right. Ready? Keep going. Slow taps. 
Now pick it up, right here. A little toe taps to that step, nice and easy. Now we're gonna go four, three, two, one, jack, jack. Four, three, two, one, jack, jack. Let's go at your own pace here. We're going for 50 seconds. Keep working. We got 10 seconds left to go. Last one right here. All right, next one. You're gonna jump up, jump down, hop side, side. Option, up, up, tap, tap. All right, ready? Let's go. So up, down, side to side. If you don't have a step, you'll just hop forward, back, then side to side. Just make that big jump forward, big jump back. So remember, option, jog it or walk it up, and you can do a little half tap. Your choice, what you need to do this morning, just get that heart rate up. Normally we'd feel that music and speed it up. I don't think we're gonna feel the music today. So, last 10 seconds, up, down, side to side. Pick up that tempo just a bit. Whoop. Come on. Give me one more. Nice job. Okay, move number three. Down, back, eight mountain climbers. Up, stand. You can stand or jump on that step. All right, we're on. Down, back, run eight, seven, four, three, two, one. Up, you know I like to jump on top. Up to you. See, if you don't have a step, just do this on the floor. You're having to go a little lower than us. So the down part is actually a little harder but you just don't get that jump on top. But still totally doable. Still gonna work hard. Come on. Nice work. 10 seconds. Give me one more. All right, next move. Move my step. You're gonna go over and back. So, ready? Let's go. Over and back. Good work. Push and push. Keep going here. I'm gonna give you an option in a minute. I call it a quick over. I'm gonna go one more. All right, quick over. It's a little one and two. It's a one and two, rock, back, one and two, rock, back. Arms up, throw them back, up, back. So you can stick with the basic over and back or give me the quick over. Whichever you like. 10 more seconds. Give me one more each way. Okay, on top of that step, we're gonna straddle. If you're on the floor, just take it out, out, jump together, out, out, jump together. Here we go. Down, down, up, up. Start easy on that straddle. Then as you want to, add a little hop. Want some more? Down, down, jump up. Want some more, jump down, jump up. Come on, stay low, squeeze those legs, down in. We have 10 seconds. It's our last cardio on the step. Give me one more. Nice work, okay. If you're watching replay, you wanna go run the living room, run the driveway, run down the street and back, go for it. 
Then come back. We're coming. Repeat. Same moves. Just on the other side with our kettlebells. So find those kettlebells again. Move number one. Serve those swings. So we're actually starting left arm this round. Ready? Here we go. Five more guys. Five. Three, two, one. Okay, keep that kettlebell. And we have the squat thrusters. So here we go. Squat down, press up. Remember option, squat, stand, press. Or squat, stand, curl. Yes, Adele, I know you're watching. That's for you. So shoulder injuries, sometimes you can't go overhead. That's okay. You can still work hard. I know Paula's gonna be watching on replay, so I'll say hi to Paula too. Hi, Paula. I know lots of you are having to watch replay because you got kiddos going on at school or little people you have to wait till nap time. I get it. I've been there. Just work out when you can. Doing something's better than nothing. Come on, give me four more. Here's two. And one. Okay, this time we're gonna alternate those swings. Here we go. Alternate left and right. Looking good, guys. Always these kettlebell swings. Hip pops, squeeze the glutes, abs, core tight, chest up. You wanna make sure you're not bending over. Just that little hip hinge, enough to get that pop to throw that weight up there. Going a few more. I know Nora and Juan were supposed to be watching this morning too, so how do you two? You're watching North Carolina. Give me four more here. Four, three, two, and one. Good work. Okay, windmills. So the other side. Let's see. I'm trying to remember which side I did last time. I think I did it this way. Nope, I think this is, that's the way I did. So this time, other side. Yep, okay, here we go. Down and up. So opposite side you did last time. Maybe I did this side, I don't remember. <laughs> I feel like I did the other side. <laughs> but maybe not. I'm really sore over here tomorrow. Oh no, I did the wrong one. Come on. See, this is why I need you in class. You can remind me which way we went. Shell can always help me remember. Come on. If I'm doing the same, make sure you're just doing the opposite. Keep going. Give me four more. There's Nora and Juan, they are watching, I guess. One more. Oh, there you are. They show me they're sweating. Okay, that's good. Me too. All right, back to those swings. So, I'm actually gonna wipe my hands off because my hands are sweaty on my kettlebells. Back to those swings this time, but both arms together. So grab that heavier kettlebell, 
We'll start low. And then when you're ready, go all the way up. As always, you do not have to go all the way up. You can stay down and it's still an awesome exercise. This is just a little more challenging. Get a little more core into play because you got to stabilize that kettlebell overhead and then throw it back down. Keep going. How about four more? Four. Two. And one. Okay, lunges. Next, yes. So we're gonna start this leg back and then here. Keep going. Chest up here. Just like before, remember, if you can't keep your chest up, just, just put those hands side to side rather than under the leg. Keep going a few more. Okay, stay under this leg this time. Under and under. So use the legs to get down. It's easy to want to use those backs, but don't do it. Chest up. Okay, if you want that extra, bring it up. Hi, Shelly and Layla. I got more friends watching. Get it, girls. Dropping something by your house in a little bit when I leave here. Good work. Give me two more. And one. All right, swings. We're going back to one arm. So we are on the right side this time. Last round of swings. Oh, I forgot our cleans on the other side a minute ago. Okay, we'll make up for it. All right, swings. I told you we had one more move, and then we go to step. But I just skipped it. <laughs> That's how you know we're live because I make mistakes, just like I do in class. At least you know I'm not a robot. It makes it more entertaining that way. Come on, squeeze. So we have cleans. After this, we'll do both sides to make up for the missed one last time. Give me four more. Four, two, and one. Okay, so cleans, since I forgot them. Got my hands off. All right, we'll do right side first, and then the left. So here on that clean, remember it's that corkscrew up, corkscrew down. Elbow stays in close. Let me come in a little bit closer, so you can see me a little better. Elbow in close. Land, remember, right in front of the chest. You don't want to land here. Remember, that's a no-no, always gets you in class. That's bad on the elbow, bad on the shoulder joint. So into the body. So I'm in between my legs, pretty much right here in between my chest, right at my chin level. So give me those cleans right here. And again, right here, you're popping those hips with that shoulder shrug. To get that high bar in. Are you and all of your children participating with me? This is recess time. Lauren homeschools all the time, so none of this is new for her. But she usually comes to my class so her kids can have PE while she works out. Come on. Give me four more. Two and one. All right, swing, catch on the other side, and let's go up. I have no idea how many we did on the other side. We're just gonna keep going. I can't talk and count at the same time. Come on. 
Again, land inside that shoulder, not outside. That's a no, no, no. Hip pop, shoulder shrug, corkscrew in, corkscrew down. Looking good, guys. Keep it going. How about four more? That feels about right, yeah? Four, three, two, and one. Good work. Okay, now we're going to the step. So step time, repeat, just lead on the other leg. So those toe taps are first, 50 seconds each. One, uh, 10 seconds to recover and show you the next move. All right, tap it out for me. Left and right, tap, tap. All right, let's pick it up. Tap, two, three, four, jack, jack. Come on. Looking good. Over halfway. We have 10 more seconds to go. Give me one more. All right. So next, jump up, jump down, hop side to side, or step up, step down, little tap side to side. Ready, three, two, one, go. Up, down, side, side. You can alternate which way you go each time. Or if you remember which way you went last time, you can go that way this time. Come on. Up, down, push those hips out. Side to side. Almost there. We're going to pick up that tempo. Here we go. Pick it up. Up, down. Side to side. If you're doing this on the floor, if you don't have the step, same move. Last one. Nice job. Recover. Mountain climbers is next. Down, eight mountain climbers. Up, stand, or jump. Here we go. Down, back, run those legs. You're going at your own pace. I'm going to face the other side. Over the top and back. Here we go. Over and back. Come on. Keep going a few more. Then we'll do that little quick over if you like that one. All right, here I go. So it's one and two. Rock back. One and two, rock back. Use those arms. The more muscles you use, the more body parts you use, the more the heart rate gets up. So push it for me. Come on. Almost there, one more each way. Nice job. Okay, on top, we have that straddle. Coming up, so down, down, up, up. We'll start easy, work our way up. Here we go. Down, down, up, up. 
Just out and in. If you're on the floor, just make it really big movements and add little hops where you can. And if you want to, out, out, jump up. Stay low here. All right, if you want to, jump down, jump up, down, up. So if you're on the floor, maybe jump down, then touch the floor like so. Even if you're on the step, you can touch. Make it a little bit harder. Keep that chest up. Give me one more. Nice job. Okay, guys. Step done. We're going one more set on the kettlebell. It'll kind of be both sides this time. And we won't do quite as many reps. We have about eight or nine minutes left. We'll go through all of this. And I'll give you a little bonus right at the very end. You always love a bonus, right? Okay, one arm swings. Let's get it. This last round, while we're not doing as many, if you have the option of two kettlebells and you have a heavy, let's try to go heavy this whole round. All right, right arm swings to start. Swings will be the same. We kind of covered them all each round, but we won't do as many. How about four more? Four. Two. And one. Okay, we have the squat thrusters. This is the one that gets you with the heavy weight. Okay. So squat down, press up. Here we go. Down, up. Slow it down if you need to. Bicep if you don't need to press. Give me two more. Nice job. All right, swing if you can and switch. Other side. And go. Down, up. Two more. And one. Good work. All right, swings. This time we're going to alternate right, left. So alternate right and left. Four more. Two. And one. Good work. Okay, windmills. I'm going to use lighter on this one, though. And I'll know I'll get both sides in since I have to do both. Okay, I'm starting kettlebell this side. So that's your right. Take it down and up. Six, halfway. We're going to do 12 on each side. Two more. And one. Good job. Swing. Switch it. Up. Press overhead. Lock it in. And let's go. Come on. Down and up. My legs are sweaty. How about yours? Come on. Come on. That was six. Six more. Oh, 
You have two more, guys. Two. And one. Get right back to those swings. So, we'll do both arms. This time, keeping that same pattern. All right, ready? Here we go. Both arms swing. Let's go. Here we go. Take it back and back. I think I forgot to hold it back on that one side. I'll give you that little bonus lunge and pulse. So we'll hit that here. We'll just alternate and then we'll do the hold and pulse on that one side that I forgot last time. See, I forget, but then I eventually remember. Hold it here, plunge. I'm on this side, down and up. Keep going. Pulse it out for me, pulse, pulse. Come on, just burn this leg out. You got one more swing, then those clean, then your bonus, then you're finished. Hang in there, come on. We're moving today, four, three, two, one. Okay, swings. So we have to do the one arm swings on the left. So, last of the swings right here on this left side. So I have no idea how many we've done today. I know we like to usually give numbers, but we did four sets each round. We did three rounds. We did at least 20 to 30, so at least 300. Probably closer to 350, I'd imagine. If anybody wants to go back and count, feel free. <laughs> I'll give you a little bonus something. Come on, a few more. How about four, three, two, and one. Okay, we're going clean to finish. All right, here we go. So start on that right side. Again, stick to your heavy kettlebell. If you have one and have that option, if not just stick to what you got. Okay, two more, we're doing 12 each side. All right, swing, switch it. Here we go. Up. Up. <clears throat> Four more. Four. Two. And one. Okay. Bonus. If you're doing my burpee challenge with me on my Facebook page, I'm gonna be nice and let you get it done with me here. So I believe if I'm remembering correctly, I didn't look, but I think Monday is kick through burpees. If I'm wrong, then just switch them for a different day. So we're on, even though we started last week on a Thursday, we still got four days in. So we're going, pretend this is week two. So we're at 20 reps. I'll give you at least 10. If we have time, I'll go ahead and do 20. So the kick through burpee, is down, back, kick through, in, up. I just kick through on one side, in and up, and then go to the other side next time. All right, this is your bonus, this is your push, let's go. Down, back, kick through, in, up. You don't have to lift that hand off the floor, you can just tap here if you need to. Woo! Woo! 
I'll go to the side so you can see a little bit. That's eight. Come on. Oh yeah, we can do 20. Come on, that's 10. 10 more, then you got those burpees done for the day. If you're not doing my burpee challenge, one, you need to. Two, you're skin burpees in anyway. Come on. That's six, you have four more. Come on, four. Last push. Two more. Here we go. Last one. Stay with me. Don't quit. All right. 20. And done. Awesome work today, guys. March it out. Bring the heart rate down. I'm sweating. All right. March it out. Take those deep breaths in through the nose. Out through the mouth. Let's step touch. Roll it back. All right, should be way up right now. Two steps. All right, walk it up. Deep breath in. Good job, guys. Stand back. How about two more? Last one. Big deep breath in. And all the way out. And then set it over to the side. Toes up for that stretch. And switch it to the other side. And come center, hands to the floor. Really stretch the back of those legs. Hands above the knees. Opposite shoulder, opposite knee. And switch, other side. Come center, roll it up. Nice and easy, roll those shoulders back. All right, here we go. Deep breath in, out. One last time, all the way up. All the way out, and you rocked it. Good work, guys, be proud. Have a great day. I'll be back Wednesday, 10, 15. See you then.